Hi guys, welcome to Equ English Learning. Today's session is very really interesting one because we are about to discuss the most overused word in English, and that word is very. Very we use a number of times. Uh, we use once, twice, thrice. It's okay, but when it is overused, it uh, looks redundant. It looks like a repetition. So to avoid that, we have many other adverbs, many other words to use in place of very. So today we are learning. We are about to learn what other words are, what other synonyms are for the word. very because uh, very is used to stress upon something like to make something or adjective or adverb very stronger or to make uh, emphasis to make that word or adjective more emphatic it is required but requirement may be fulfilled using synonyms using other words so today let us start with other words for very in place of very what other words we may use i'm starting with the first word that you may use in place of very that is absolutely absolutely this is the first word second word i am going to give you is actually actually third word extremely extremely we are using words in place of very then we have emphatically emphatically okay next one is exceptionally exceptionally now next is notably notably what these words are we are supposed to use replacing the word very next one is intensely intensely these are adverbs because very is adverb and we are supposed to replace it we have to use adverbs and the the remarkable point of adverb or the identifying point of adverb is we use ly at the end we generally use ly at the end it is not always but generally they are identified because they have ly at the end that shows in the word is adverb now after intensely we have markedly we have markedly next word we have severely severely then continuing with this strikingly strikingly okay then uh, i may give more words next word i give you powerfully powerfully so next word we have quite q u i t e here no ly is used i told you that 90% of the adverbs are having ly at the end but a few are without ly also then i have really really adverb so continue with the list more adverbs i have to use in place of very then quite really next one is remarkably remarkably this is good word then i have truly using truly in place of very after truly we have unusually unusually next one is verily it sounds like very but it is different from very is verily now we have wonderfully wonderfully is a good word that can be used for very that can replace very very well next one is particularly particularly this is again good word then we have utterly 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 the next one next adverb that we can use in place of very is incredibly incredibly that may we, we may use then we have downright again this adverb is without the use of ly it is not ending with ly but it is adverb then we have exceedingly exceedingly we can use for very we have surprisingly surprisingly again very good word good adverb then pointedly pointedly is again nice word then we have particularly particularly we will be using them in exercise also then we have prominently 
prominently so these are some of the adverbs some verbs some words that you can use in place of very always using very makes speech boring makes listless so we are supposed to use these adverbs so let us come to exercise the first sentence i have written here is i am very upset today very a word is used here very adverb is used i am very upset today so what a different word we can use here in place of very what a different adverb we can use here i am actually i can write here i am actually very upset today this is good one i am actually very upset or you may also say that i am notably everyone may note that because when one is very upset everyone may note that so notably upset today both are correct and other words may also fit here but i am using only two she looks very beautiful again we are concerned with very she looks very beautiful what a different adverb can be used here i can use here she looks extremely beautiful it is showing the degree of her beauty intensity of her beauty so instead of very i am using she is extremely she looks extremely beautiful in her dress this is a good word summers are very hot now the very here is troublesome summers are very hot in a country so we are supposed to use any other adverb out of the list that i have given you what you can use summers are emphatically or exceptionally okay right i right here summers are exceptionally hot in a country that means they are extremely oh i may use extremely hot in a country during summers or it is unusually i may also use unusually it means that is not very common that is very unusual that is exceptional so is summers are exceptionally hot or summers are unusually hot in our country so this is replacing very and they are sounding good enough now this one is a small story on the i will read it for you first on the very hot day the very tall woman and a very small dog walked very quickly along the very long road we have very how many times used here one two three four and five times in three lines so this is redundancy so redundancy should be removed we have to use this very but in different way let us start so on the very hot day again the same one very hot day you may use on the extremely hot day or you may say on uh, on the exceedingly hot day on the particularly hot day i may write particularly here on the particularly hot day this is good enough or you may use on the assuredly hot day actually hot day absolutely hot day you may also use here absolutely on the absolutely hot day it was very hot it means the very tall woman i have to use another word for this very now very tall woman what word what adverb can be used uh, the quite tall woman so quite tall woman of course or you may say remarkably tall woman you may use any word here out of that list very quite tall woman and a very small dog very small dog so what other adverb may be used uh, really small dog okay that's fine another one you may uh, use here uh, very really small dog instead of very you may use wonderfully small dog you may use notably small dog you may use markedly small dog okay all the adverbs are good enough walked very quickly now we have to replace this very walked very quickly so very quickly may be replaced by quickly is not to be replaced very i am going to replace uh, you may say here really quickly you may say very really quickly that is uh, good enough or uh, you may say exceedingly quickly you may say severely quickly you may say exceptionally quickly all are good enough exceptionally that is uncommonly quickly along the very long road very long road means unusually long road wonderfully long road or you may say downright long road this is good one any adverb any word out of the list may replace very and the sentences are sounding different i am actually upset today 
is good enough she looks extremely beautiful in this dress okay summers are exceptionally hot in our country fine this is good on the very hot day on the particularly hot day the quite tall woman and a really small dog walked exceptionally quickly along the downright long road that is the usage of very very with the different words with new words and this vocabulary is supposed to help you is gonna help you a lot so uh, in future from i mean to say from today even you can start using these words whenever the very word comes on your tip just replace with any of these words you have a wonderful choice you have a great choice so you would be using very but not in that way but in this way using synonyms for the very so for next session there would be something more interesting till then keep watching my videos and also you do like this and subscribe also till then stay well grow well thanks